Hey everybody, Matthew Cook here, founder and CEO of GTC Golf Academy. And right now I'm gonna show you how to get into a good posture. Now, I'm using the driver, but the same principles apply with any sort of iron, uh, from pitching wedge all the way to your long irons, uh, into your woods. Posture is just critical and crucial in, uh, in preparing your body for the movement that it's about to take and obviously the swing that you're about to make. So, um, we're gonna go ahead and get set up to the golf ball. And, you know, you, <laughs> you might feel like you're gonna look a little silly on the range doing this, but I promise you, you're not. All I want you to do is get set up into what you feel is your setup position posture right now. And from here, you're going to jump in the air and land. And I want you to feel like you're in a very athletic position and that you you are being very athletic jump land and from the jumping and landing you start to flex your knees your hips um, and you start to get a little lighter on your feet you start to position the pressure in your feet into a position where you're able to move and you're quite agile uh, you know something is to be said for agility and it's why we work with junior golfers at a young age to be uh, better with their agility because it's necessary in the golf swing so all you can do is just three times jump and land jump and land jump and land and now I just want you to keep feeling that you know if you need to just have a little bounce with your knees uh, I know that they say <laughs> I know that they say like the hackers do that but for the purposes of this exercise is actually very good so from here you've done three jumps and lands and you've got a little bit of flex at your knees you, you're, you've got some um, bend at your pelvis. So the, bu the buckle, if you have a belt buckle and it's somewhat pointing down towards the ground. Now you're in a very much athletic position in order to hit the golf ball. And hit it pretty good like that. That was probably one of the best drives I've hit all day because my posture was better. So jumping and landing, jumping and landing, jumping and landing three times. It's gonna give you a better sensation, a better feeling. It's gonna put you in a, in a much better, a more athletic position at addressing. That's what we want. I don't like seeing golfers um, very static in, in the sense that they look like they can't move. Like they, they look like they can't go right, left very quickly. You know, I, I see it quite often with the golfer that I work with the most, the golfers that are shooting the mid 80s or, or trying to break 80, uh, some golfers shooting low, mid, low 90s, high 80s. They tend to get very stiff, very, very stiff at address, locking, uh, well, not, not, not exactly locking, you can't lock your joints, but they look very stiff and like they can't move the club very well. Rather, if you just jump and land, you won't be able to do that very well if you're not in an athletic position. So, simple drill, uh, simple exercise, more, more like, not necessarily a drill. Don't worry, you won't look silly on the range, like you're getting yourself into a very good posture, very good setup position. Try that, you're gonna put yourself in almost perfect condition with your golf posture.